All right, greetings YouTube and fellow cigar box guitar enthusiasts. Dale Puckett here, and in this video I want to talk about the zero fret. All right, what is a zero fret? A zero fret is a fret in place of the nut. Now, so what I do is I cut a fret slot exactly on that leading edge of where the nut goes. Okay, now this is just a standard template. Um, you don't want to go an anywhere but that right at that leading edge, right? And that's where your nut, or your fret slot, your zero fret slot is going to be. Now I use a jumbo fret, which is a larger, about almost twice as large as a, as a regular medium fret. I usually use medium frets throughout the neck and then a jumbo for the zero fret. And the reason being is because it's a little bit higher fret and I use a 0 0.052 size crown size for the um, jumbo fret but that allows me to cut little grooves into it and I have this guitar here as an example here's the jumbo zero fret and these are all mediums but here notice this angle right here I have this these eyelets and this screw here to kind of hold the strings down here and I, I picked this one here as an example because it's got a severe angle right there and I get questions all the time, is it these threads that hold the string in place? Uh, the answer is, I'm sure it helps, but really what holds it in place here is these, these downward angle here. And of course I cut these little file little grooves into the zero fret there. And I'll show you what I mean by that. I get a little triangle file. And here's one that I'm working on. And what I do is I just, uh, I'll find the center, and I like to do, do this, these little s grooves at an angle. And then I'll find the center. And it doesn't have to be deep, just, um, just enough to kind of hold it in place. And then I come about, about an eighth of an inch up from the edge. And then about an eighth of an inch down from the top. you can see that there so pretty easy uh, the reason why I use a, a zero fret is a number of reasons number one it's easy it's easier to do a to cut a fret slot put a fret in there and file little grooves you know one and done you're done and it ensures um, uniform action from build to build to build to build and um, obviously intonation is a good thing, right? So if you're careful and you cut that, um, your, your zero fret slot right on that, on that leading edge, right? You're pretty much guaranteed that you'll have, um, good intonation. Of course, your bridge and your saddle has to be appropriately positioned to match the scale length of your template, but that's pretty much it. Um, again, the reason why in a nutshell, the reason why I do zero fret is probably because I'm lazy. So that's it. If you have any questions, be sure to ask them, and I will try my best to answer them. And hopefully you get something out of this video.